Hello everyone, Steve from Tech Toy Tinker in Retro Arena. I wanted to do a quick video to show you guys something like a, a side project that I'm working on for my own fun. It's using an Odroid M1S and a VU8S 8-inch touchscreen display. So, the Odroid here is on the bottom, along with the legs and the ribbon cable. It's in this casing here. And the, dis the display here is, of course, touchscreen. Also, it can be run from an 18650 battery. So it's a portable option as well. Now, I don't know how many of you out there have heard of the Arcade 1UP Infinity game table, but I have one. And it's something that my kids and my wife and I quite enjoyed playing with. So, when I first got the Odroid M1S, I made Retro Arena for it, which is still in beta, but available for download. And I saw it came with two legs and this screen for me to play with that works with Android and Linux. So the idea is, it came with two legs, you set it up on the side so that it's kind of sitting like this, and you have a display that kind of goes with your device. Your device hooks onto the back and whatnot, and... Away you go, right? So I decided to add two more legs to it, make it into a tabletop, and kind of make an 8-inch arcade 1-up infinity table. So I'll give you a quick idea as to how it works. It's running an RK3566 board, which ironically is actually the same as the infinity table. Now, for audio, there's no headphone jack, and it obviously doesn't have a speaker when you're plugging it in. You can use HDMI with this board, which will work fine, but it doesn't have a speaker for the... Uh, screen. So you can use Bluetooth, you can use USB to uh, 3.5. You can also use the GPIO pins. I'm using Bluetooth here in this video. You can actually use your computer as your Bluetooth receiver as well. So you can get it from the Windows Store. It's called Bluetooth Audio Receiver. You just Bluetooth connect your device to your PC and then turn the app on. I'm just going to show you quickly. I'm not going to get deep into it. So as you can see, for those of you that are aware of the Infinity Table, it does the same thing, just a much smaller scale version of it. However, it's not locked to the Arcade 1UP software, so you can do a whole lot more with it. It's a fully open Android... <coughs> Excuse me. A little cough there. But yeah, it's completely open. There's no bootloader locked. It's completely rooted, so you can do whatever you want with it. Honestly, I prefer having an 8-inch tabletop to a 32-inch that needs to be the table. Also, I installed Daijo on here. Now, you can use the touchscreen to play, obviously, or in this instance here, I'm using a 8-bit do controller, courtesy of A Neo. Shout out to A Neo, as always. Gotta detect. Uh, let's go with MGBA. Just because. So as you can see, you can run emulation on here without having a bunch of trouble setting it up because you're not restricted and having to break out of the arcade one-up table. It might actually be possible to replace your board in your arcade one-up table with this, but it would take a lot of work that I don't really want to put into it. Now, God of War is never going to run good, but your more uh, normal, average games should be fine. 
Redream works okay too. So Dreamcast PSP you can run on this. Again, I don't want to go too deep into showing any videos because that's not the point. I don't want to keep you guys here for an hour. I'm just kind of giving you an overview of the project. You can see Super User is there. You got Drastic. That's about all I wanted to show you guys. It's, it's a work in progress. It is using the stock build provided by hard kernel however as you can see here i went in and i magisk patched the kernel and i haven't even gotten to install the apk yet but it's there i'm gonna go ahead and wrap the video up here that's just a quick look at it again this is the odroid m1s using the vu8s screen i like it because it's portable it's battery powered or wall powered you can let it sit just on your coffee table or wherever and you take it with you as always though thank you for watching don't forget to like and subscribe hope you enjoyed the video take care